Today, we will discuss the interesting facts on how to better understand ball pythons. Ball pythons are native to the Midwest of Africa. A ball python's eyesight is not great, and like all snakes, they do not have eyelids. Please, don't get into a staring contest with a snake. To help them sense the world around them, ball pythons come equipped with heat-sensing pits over the top of their lips, kind of like a highly evolved mustache. Ball pythons are considered to be the Gene Simmons of the animal kingdom, on account how they flick their tongues in and out. This is their way of smelling the environment around them, by picking up surrounding scent particles. Once the snake has tracked its prey, it will give it a big hug until it has been killed. This is because ball pythons are known as constrictors. These consumers of worlds can eat one meal a week, or even once per month. I wish I had that kind of self-control. The good news, however, is that they only poop as much as they eat. So make sure to clean up that poo when it comes around. Ball pythons like to take regular baths, so make sure to equip the habitat with a water bowl. These little fellows are shy, so they also need a rock or some sort of hiding layer. One last thing you should probably know about making your fella comfy is to include a heating pad. Ball pythons are very easy to handle because of their docile nature. They curl up into a ball when they are afraid, which is why they are called ball pythons. When handling a python, make sure to grab the snake by the chunkier section of the body or tail. Now that you know how to care for a ball python, you can decide whether it's the right pet for you. If you currently have a snake and have decided you no longer want it in your home, please do not let it loose into the wild. Find a proper home for it like an animal shelter, or wildlife refuge, or someone else who likes snakes. Until next time, my snake-loving friends, a ta-ta for now.